you're new here, I'm Lorena. Today I'm sharing a spring inspired tablescape with you guys. So when you're watching this, Easter already passed, but when I'm filming this, it's in two days and my mom is in town visiting. So I really wanna do an Easter breakfast for her and I thought it would be nice to also create a tablescape to go with it. I really love doing either seasonal tablescapes or for different holidays. I keep my decor, my dining table really simple. I don't leave them out, but if I'm hosting or wanting to make a lunch or dinner extra special, I love creating a tablescape and it's gonna be more spring-like than Easter. So I thought I would share with you guys in case you're wanting to host something for spring, like a lunch or brunch, or this can even work for Mother's Day. So hopefully you enjoy and get some ideas. Just removing what I currently have up for spring on my dining table and then once we're done with the tablescape decor then I will remove that and then put this up again. That way it's just nice and simple here on the table and first I'm just wiping it down before I get started. All right, I'm doing fresh flowers for the center of the table and I got these from Costco and I love them. They're super bright and spring-like and I'm doing more of a bud face look in the center of the table instead of like one large arrangement. So I'm using these cups with the rattan. I also pulled out these bud vases. We'll see if I end up using these or if I just do those cups. And I have these flowers already in, on my island and they're looking kind of droopy and we're just gonna use them along with these to add to the cups just to make them nice and colorful. I really love these rattan wrapped glasses. They're perfect for spring and summer. Of course, they're functional to use if you wanna drink from them, but I really love to use them as decor, especially in the summer. They end up looking so pretty on this tablescape, but once I'm done with that, I can use them as decor on a shelf or inside my glass cabinet by the dining table. I got them from Target a couple of years ago and I don't see them available, but I'll try to link some similar ones below. I'm just adding a few flowers to each of them and they will go in the center of the table. And when I'm doing tablescapes, I try to stick with lower decor so you can see everyone around the table and not have anything too bulky in the middle. So something like this is perfect. Just a very casual, pretty look for spring. I ended up using four flowers for each of the glasses and tried to do one of each color. I also added the flowers from my island like I mentioned and I also did two of the small bud vases and I really love how this ended up looking. For the summer I can also redo this with different flowers, maybe some brighter ones and it's just a really simple tablescape to recreate. To start the tablescape, I'm using this linen fabric as a table runner. I got this fabric from Hobby Lobby to use for my spring decor. I cut about a yard and I've already cut a couple pieces to make some ribbons and tie bows around some baskets for my spring decor. 
and I really love this linen material it looks so pretty for spring and since that is all that I have left over I thought I could use it for my tablescape I would love it if I had more left so it could be longer and cover more of the table and drape over the sides but I think it looks just fine for a casual look which is what I'm going for and good enough length to work as an anchor for the flowers in the middle and then these placemats are also from Hobby Lobby and I love that they also have that woven rattan material so they tie in well with the glasses. And I'm just using these white square plates for this tablescape. Usually I'll do a smaller plate on top, but just keeping it simple for this one. And then I'm going to place a napkin on top and just doing a very simple fold. These napkins are from Hobby Lobby. I got them during the fall season, but I really love that lined look. They're pretty casual and can just be used year round. And I'm doing a few folds long ways and then tying it in the middle just to have like a knot in the middle. Super simple to do. And then I'm gonna actually take some little flowers and put them right in the middle where the knot is. And I think it looks really pretty, really casual and simple. these dried flowers here in my coffee bar and I was thinking of taking a couple stems to add to the napkins just to kind of tuck them in there and I think I'll do two yellow two of the pink just to give a little bit more color And just finishing off with the napkin on top of the plate, I did a yellow and a pink on each side and that completed the look. And I love how colorful and cheerful it turned out. I really love doing these tablescapes, like I said, for different seasons and holidays. And this one was really fun and simple to do. And hopefully you got some ideas today and enjoyed. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you on my next one.